taking my family off one by one. Let's fight like demons. Hi and welcome to Select 10. As we know, the best sci-fi movies take us to places beyond our own imagination, and a great sci-fi movie delivers mind-bending visuals, packed with mind-blowing ideas, probing everything from the human experience to the future of humanity. So get ready, we have picked 10 best science fiction movies, currently available on Netflix, Disney+, HBO Max, and Amazon Prime. So watch full video to avoid missing any movie from this list. Now let's start the video. Number 10. What happened to Monday? It is a 2017 dystopian sci-fi action thriller film, directed by Tommy Wirkola. The movie is set, around 2043, where overpopulation has caused a worldwide crisis, resulting in a strict one-child policy, enforced by the Child Allocation Bureau. And the main plot follows, a family of identical septuplets, seven genetically identical girls, who live in a world, where due to overpopulation, each household is allowed only one child. But when one of the sisters named Monday goes missing, the others must find her, while remaining unknown to the outside world. Overall, the story is unique, yet very interesting to watch. If you love sci-fi mystery with good action, then this should be your pick. And the movie has 6.8 rating on IMDb and 67% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 9. Attack the Block. It is a 2011 sci-fi comedy horror film, written and directed by Joe Cornish. The movie is set in South London and follows the story of a teen gang of tough inner city kids who make an unlikely alliance to try to defend their turf against an invasion of savage alien creatures who are turning a South London apartment complex into an intergalactic war zone. The movie is surprisingly funny, scary, and dark at the same time, and most importantly, it is highly entertaining. Overall, it is a really good sci-fi film, and you should definitely consider watching it. And it has 6.6 .6 rating on IMDb and 90% critic score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 8. Pitch Black. It is a 2000 science fiction action horror film, directed by David Twoey. The movie is set in distant future and follows dangerous criminal Richard B. Riddick, who is being transported to prison in a spacecraft. But when the spaceship is damaged by comet debris and makes an emergency crash landing on an empty desert planet, Riddick escapes. However, when predatory alien creatures begin attacking the survivors, Riddick joins forces with the surviving crew and other passengers to develop a plan to escape the planet. Overall, it is a crazy sci-fi horror adventure, from the beginning to the end, and definitely worth watching. And the movie has 7.1 rating on IMDb and 77% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 7. Eternals. Even if you have not watched all Marvel films, you can still watch this movie, as it is not directly connected to the previous films. This superhero sci-fi film is directed by Chloe Zhao, and it is based on the Marvel comics of the same name, and it is the 26th film in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. The movie is set in 5000 BC and follows 10 Eternals from the planet Olympia, are sent by the Celestial Erisham to Earth to fight the invasive deviants. Over the millennia, they protected humanity from the deviants, but are not allowed to interfere in human evolution. They killed the last of the deviants in 1500, and spent the next 500 years mostly separated from each other, waiting for Erisham to send them home. The main story is set, after the events of Avengers Endgame, where an unexpected tragedy bought deviants back, and forced Eternals, who have been living on Earth in secret for thousands of years, to reunite and save mankind from the deviants. And the movie has 6.4 rating on IMDb and 78% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 6. Freaks. It is a 2018 science fiction thriller film, written and directed by Zach Lepofsky and Adam Stein. The story follows a seven-year-old girl, Chloe, who lives with her father and told that the outside world was dangerous and was spending lonely days in her house. But one day, she left the house while her father was asleep and she was approached by an old man in an ice cream truck, standing in front of her house. The old man, who is Chloe's grandfather, tells her about the fact that Chloe's mother is alive and the mysterious power she has. Chloe, who was scolded by her father for going out, awakened her special ability by raising her emotions. 
As the movie progresses, the trio put their differences aside to mount an escape to save Chloe's mother, who's presumed dead, but actually imprisoned in an underground facility. Tell me honestly, how many of you watched this movie? This one is so underrated, and if you have not watched it yet, then I suggest you to add this movie to your watch list. And it has 6.7 rating on IMDb, an 88% critic score, on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 5. Equilibrium. It is a 2002 dystopian sci-fi action film, written and directed by Kurt Wimmer. The film is set in 2072, a futuristic world, which eliminated war by suppressing emotions and feeling is a crime punishable by death. And the main story follows, John Preston, a top-ranking government agent, responsible for destroying those who resist these rules. But when he misses a dose of prosium, a mind-altering drug that hinders emotion, Preston begins to experience emotions, which makes him question his morality and moderate his actions, while attempting to remain undetected by the suspicious society in which he lives. Ultimately, he aids a resistance movement, using advanced martial arts, which he was taught by the regime he is helping to overthrow. I know many of you might not heard about this movie, but believe me, it is one of the best sci-fi, with a unique story and concept, that will stay on your mind for a while. And it has 7.4 rating on IMDb, an 81% audience score, on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 4. Prometheus. It is a 2012 science fiction horror film, directed by Ridley Scott. The movie takes place in the late 21st century and centers on the crew of the spaceship, Prometheus, as they follow a star map discovered among the remnants of several ancient Earth cultures that led them to a distant world and an advanced civilization. While the main story focuses on two brilliant young scientists that lead the expedition as they seek the origins of humanity and hopes that they will meet a race of benevolent godlike beings who will in some way verify her religious beliefs but instead discovers a threat that could cause the extinction of the human race. If you are a fan of Alien movie franchise, then you will love this one. The story is really good, and without a doubt, after Alien 1986, it is the next best movie in this franchise. And it has 7 rating on IMDb and 73% critic score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 3. Ex Machina. It is a 2014 science fiction film, written and directed by Alex Garland. The story follows Caleb, a 26-year-old programmer at the world's largest internet company, wins a competition to spend a week at a private mountain retreat belonging to Nathan, the reclusive CEO of the company. But when Caleb arrives at the remote location, he finds that he will have to participate in a strange and fascinating experiment in which he must interact with the world's first true artificial intelligence, housed in the body of a beautiful robot girl named Ava. Caleb soon learns that he has been chosen to be the human component in a Turing test to determine the capabilities and consciousness of Aeva. However, it soon becomes evident that Aeva is far more self-aware and deceptive than either man imagined. Overall, it is a great sci-fi film with an excellent story that keeps you on the edge of your seat. And the movie has 7.7 .7 rating on IMDb and 92% critic score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 2. Minority Report. It is a 2002 science fiction film, directed by Steven Spielberg, and the story is loosely based on the 1956 short story, The Minority Report, by Philip K. Dick. The film is set in Washington, D.C., in the year 2054, where pre-crime, a specialized police department, utilize a psychic technology to arrest and convict murderers before they commit their crime. While the main story follows, John Anderton, the head of this pre-crime unit, who gets accused of the future murder of a man he hasn't even met. To save himself, he decides to get to the mystery's core by finding out the minority report that might prove his innocence. Overall, the film combines the elements of technology, murder mystery thriller, and science fiction genres. If you ask me, it is a one of the best sci-fi film I have ever seen, and every sci-fi fan should watch this movie. Believe me, you do not want to miss this one. And it has 7.7 .7 rating on IMDb and 90% critic score on Rotten Tomatoes. On number 1. Dune. It is a 2021 epic science fiction film directed by Denis Villeneuve. It is the first of a two-part adaptation of the 1965 novel by Frank Herbert and the movie primarily covers the first half of the book. The story is set in the far future and follows Paul Atreides and his family the noble house Atreides, who are thrust into a war for the dangerous desert planet called Arrakis. 
Arrakis is a harsh desert planet and the only source of spice, a valuable substance that extends human vitality and is critical for interstellar travel. But when malevolent forces explode into conflict over the planet's exclusive supply of the most precious resource in existence, Paul must travel to the most dangerous planet in the universe to ensure the future of his family and his people. The story is brilliant and the movie is visually stunning and has mind-boggling cinematography. Overall, this movie is a thematic feast for sci-fi fans and it has 8.1 rating on IMDb and 90% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. That's it for today, thank you for watching this video. And do subscribe our channel to see more videos related to movies and series suggestions.